यू कैन सेटअप एंड असाइन प्रोडक्ट कैटेगरीज टू डिफरेंट आइटम्स इन क्विक बुक्स ऑनलाइन टू बेटर ऑर्गेनाइज योर डेटा and to later analyze it using different segment and in this video i'm going to show you how i'll head over to the products and services from the sales menu then click on more and manage categories this brings up the product category page i have design landscaping and pest control as the main categories with fountains and sprinklers as sub categories i'll create a new category enter the name and save kaboom I'll then enter a category for video editing and make it a subcategory of editing. I can set up up to four levels of categories after which I'll get an error from QuickBooks. You have several options when it comes to assigning a product category to an item. I'll quickly create a new YouTube video editing service item and save it without assigning a category. I can then select edit from the action column and then select a category for the item. I'll create a new detective service item and this time I'll assign the product category while creating this item. Now I can select one of the available categories or I can create a new category on the fly. But when I create a category on the fly, I cannot make it a subcategory. that can be done only from the product categories page you can use various customization options to filter and view items by product category but when you are creating reports you can actually create different segments using the product category as the filter if you want to find the best selling product from particular product category then you can create the sales by product service report and use the filter option to filter out items of a particular product category so head over to the reports page and then select the sales by product service report from the customize option apply the filter and select product service mark all categories that you want to include in the report i'm going to go with design then select run report and you have a nice sales by product service detail report filtered for the design category you can select multiple categories when filtering data for this report you can see the top selling products or services for a particular category you can also save the customization so that you can quickly view the same report with the same filters a quick and dirty trick if you want to regularly review this report and you can do the same with summary reports you can use the inventory valuation report to find the actual value of the stock that you are holding for an item or product category you can customize the report and apply the product service filter and choose the category that you want to filter for and then you have physical inventory worksheet to physically count and update the stock information in quickbooks once you have applied the product category filter you can print out the report to perform a physical inventory count that is count each item one by one like manually if you are a part of a merchandising or manufacturing business then you are going to love this fun let's say you just want to view all of the products that you have ordered but they haven't yet been delivered and you want to view them by their product category you can use the purchase order detail report to find all the items that you have ordered but not received the purchases by product service detail has the new enhanced experience that is still in development you can use the filter option directly to get data for a particular category of items choose the filter the operation and the value which in this case is the product category drop your questions in the comment section below and if you found this video helpful then hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more content on quickbox